Hi guys, Mr. Squeegee here for Window Cleaning Institute. Just uh, broke out uh, my new uh, H2 Pro today. <clears throat> Thanks to Sean Gavin for getting that out to me. Uh, it's a great little system. I got the one without a pump. Since I already had the Wayne pump, I thought I'd uh, see what that could do. And here at this house, I was doing uh, 40 with just the tap pressure, 40 PSI, when it was coming into the system. And uh, uh, with my other system, I was uh, losing some pressure. It had multiple ROs. I really think the single RO is uh, a little a little better for, for building pressure because uh, this pump is rated to boost your incoming tap pressure by about uh, 40 PSI. Now with the other system, if I had 40, 40 PSI tap pressure, uh, I'd be getting probably on the system, I could do 65, maybe 70. Uh, depending, uh, which uh, the ROs are designed to run efficiently a little better than that. Uh, you need a little more pressure than that to run them at optimum. But uh, this one, when I threw the uh, pump on there, I was about a little better than 40, probably 45. Uh, I was able to pressurize the system. My gauge read 90 PSI, so I was getting uh, really good uh, containment of pressure I was putting into the system. So. Uh, all in all, I'm very happy. I had over 500 TDS at this uh, house, and then coming out of the RO, I was getting uh, a reading of 20. So, cold water tends to drop your uh, RO efficiency, but here I was getting really good efficiency. So, very happy. Nice sized uh, carbon filter, great size DI. I'm not going to have to be changing that thing out all the time uh, like I would on a smaller system. So, all in all, I, I may invest in a, a larger. Uh, on-demand pump, but uh, extremely happy with it. Performed really well today. So, uh, shout out to Sean Gavin at Reach Higher Ground, and uh, that's my thoughts on the H2 Pro, guys. See you on the forum.